Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we're playing Wreckfest and we're going to do some online racing. First race today then is going to be at the Fire Rock Raceway. These are all going to be C class races and I'm going to start in the Raiden. 12 of us in this race then, 6 laps. Let's see how we get on. Just going to take it easy around this first corner. Now it's going to be coming into a real tight right hand corner here. So just got to try and hold our position, getting pushed wide, Whoa, just managed to ride off the barriers, back in ninth place, not the best of starts, Let's see if we can slide up the inside of some of these into this tight left hand corner, got a good run up the inside, just pushing that star beast round though, made up a few places. Oh, right on my tail then as we come into this long right hand corner little flick on the back end but that just really helped me uh, turn into the corner that car is all over the back of me right it's going to be dangerous turning tight onto this right onto the straight we can slip up the inside of that one though up into fifth place then train of cars chasing me down behind this first corner is fairly quick, you can just ease off or break slightly and uh, slide around here. Just got to watch that sign post on the, uh, on the inside though. Got an, a little gap to break for this tight right hand corner, chasing these two down behind me. Just back wheels over the grass but the car behind it exactly the same so they've not closed down at all. Right, come wide for this and then turn in sharp. Those two are pushing each other wide, they're going to slow each other down which might allow me to uh, catch up slightly. Leader is already quite a few seconds ahead of us all. Trying to watch out for second place actually. Can't see them visually ahead. So I'm guessing they are up with first place. Oh, through the tyres there. That wasn't a very uh, good corner. Back onto the straight then. Settled into a bit of a gap, it seems, behind this fifth place, uh, behind this fourth place. Sorry. Third has pulled slightly ahead now. First place still about six, seven seconds ahead. Seem to be pulling a little bit of a gap back to uh, sixth place behind. But I am struggling to. I can. I seem to just about be able to hold, hold position with uh, third and fourth. Hold on to them, but uh, struggling to catch up. Yeah, I can see first on the first and second on the map now. They are sort of strung out ahead. Need a couple of nice tidy corners to try and uh, close up on the back of this car in front, if possible. We're well away from 6th place now, they're about 10-11 seconds behind as we come over the line for the halfway stage. 3 laps to go, that car has gone wide, that hopefully will allow me to close up slightly. Another lock up of brakes as we come around this tight right hand corner and again they've gone wide. Starting to uh, make a few mistakes so hopefully we can get onto the back. We are much quick, quicker around some of these real tight corners, I think, which you'd expect in the Raiden compared with, I think that's a star beast ahead. But uh, they do have probably a good, good advantage over us pace-wise once we get onto the straight sections. So I've just got to use that advantage around the corner, see if I can close in. If I can get a good right-hand corner here, then we're certainly closer than we have been for quite a few laps now. Looks like third place has pulled away slightly in front. Leader's slowly pulling away as well. They're seven, eight seconds ahead now. Right, can we get past this car? Right on the back. Nice, fast around this right hand section and get ready for a good line through this really tight left hand corner. We should be quicker through here we might be able to get up the inside yeah they've drifted wide every time up alongside but then they've got that acceleration and speed advantage as we pull away just 
going to try and keep closing down there if I can. Don't make any silly lunges that's going to uh, cost me time. Just if I can keep closing, we will get a good chance before the end. I'm sure they've gone a bit sideways there. We've got a good run here. We're up alongside as we come down the straight. And of course, I'm going to be on the inside if I hold this position. Just going to edge wide and turn in slightly late. Leave them out to dry slightly. And obviously, that's going to... Uh, put us in a bit of a vulnerable position here they've slipped up the inside I can't really defend that at all if I'd have turned in I'd have probably been off hopefully we're going to get another chance here though on every lap previously they've won, run well wide on this corner if they do the same again maybe we'll get another chance they have gone wide again and again we're up alongside but can't get past we've only got a few more corners now before the end can we get in front need a really good corner here and a fast exit through onto these last couple of corners need to be in a good position for the final right hand corner I need to carry a lot of speed through there if possible hope they make a bit of a mistake try to run through as quick as I can ah, touch the barriers she's probably just lost a little bit of momentum not sure we would have caught them anyway really good fun race but it's going to have to be a fifth position let's see what the lap times were like 59 seconds for us, yeah, quite a few cars a second or a second and a half quicker than us. Okay, challenge two today is at the Crash Canyon. I have switched out the Raiden and I am in the Star Beast for this one. Oh, and that car is not moving. I've had a bit of a slow start there. Oh, come on, man, you go. This is not the best start at all. I mean we didn't take too much damage at least because it was just uh, pushing into another car rather than hitting them but really held us up, really bad start. We're off and running now though, up into 7th place. Yeah this isn't the Star Beast SS, this is just the Star Beast but um, and B class I've got this tuned up and with a little bit of armour as well so it's it's not overly strong but it's probably, I don't know what strength it's got, I didn't look but it's probably four point something maybe something like that so it's got a little bit about it oh that was a big crash there just pinged off the inside of both of us bit of a spinner there a couple gone wide can I sneak up nope got taken back anyway so still in seventh at least we are a lot closer now to these cars just in front or oh, just uh <laughs> I think it was that a raid and I just caught the back end of it and it turned into the uh, into the corner and then flipped over can't defend that though but I might be able to get a good run on the exit of this corner as we come back onto the straight again can I slip up the inside of this one maybe just got to watch because they're likely to push me into the side so I'm going to back off again better to have a good entry into here can I slip right up the inside of all of them made up a few places there on that corner up into fourth place now a couple chasing behind there is a bit of a gap though so I might be able to break and turn into this corner before getting the back end here I'm going to run in slightly quicker than normal oh, car going around the other way don't know if that's a back marker or they are fighting for position and they've just chosen to go around the other way still in our fourth place leader is not far ahead them involved in this crash we're all the lead group are involved in this can we slip through we are up the inside and up into a lead obviously that will have bunched the whole pack behind because we've all been held up but we are up into the lead for the first time of the race and that isn't a bad thing if that actually has bunched the pack up behind us because it means there's going to be less cars possibly coming down the opposite direction into us if they're all uh, fairly close behind on that car on the side already in fact was it wrecked I'm not sure yeah it was wrecked couldn't quite see with the map against the uh, the background the sandy colour background but I could see it now okay start of lap 5 so the halfway stage then still up in the lead but there's a lot of cars fairly close behind or within a couple of seconds Again, we've got a good clear run down here. Oh, spoke too soon. Thought I was totally clear and we've had a massive head on. Damn, 
that's lost us a lot of places and a lot of damage as well. I didn't see that till the last minute, couldn't do anything about it anyway, wasn't expecting it. I was sort of looking on the map for any bat markers and uh, before I knew it, it was right on top of us. To be honest, I, was, I wasn't expecting that anyone to be there. I thought everyone was either chasing behind or there was a couple gone past on the on the opposite lane before. Sixth place then. Still a few laps left though, so anything can happen. Behind a train of four cars here, so there's a possibility of making up a few places. Leader is about nine, eight, nine, ten seconds ahead now. Saying that they've just lost a bit of time by the look of it. I guess they've been held up on this corner in some way. Quite a few wrecked cars now. We obviously took a lot of damage on that big hit that we had, but uh, we have still got over 50. 51 damage, is it? And there's obviously not much of the race left. It's a fourth place then, right behind these two having a great battle. That's the leader I think, eight, nine seconds ahead. But this is probably second and third, up into third very momentarily there. Don't want to fight that too hard, I'd rather get a good run down here if possible. Can we get up past? Nope. Okay, let's uh, again try and get a good corner, slip our nose up the inside and push them wide. Back market in the way. Yeah, they're not going to get round there now. Can we get second place as well? We've got a bit of a run here. Not sure we've got anywhere to go with it. Yeah, I can't get past. Pretty good race though. And a third overall. 35.9 was our best lap. Not a bad time. Quite a few a little bit quicker, but uh, yeah, it's always a good fun race at the Crash Canyon. Third and final online race today then were at the Eagles Peak Motor Park. I'm going to stick with our uh, Star Beast for this one. See how we get on. Can I slip up the inside of this rocket and into an early knee lead? No, just getting held wide. I can take this uh, lane down the side of the ramp though and that lead, I think it was a Raiden, has sort of flipped over the side of the ramp and is off so up into a really early lead so we're going to have a big pack chasing us down and this slow left hand corner is always a bit of a tricky one right we're going to go up the right hand side here trying to miss the worst of these bumps makes for a slightly quicker run and then sling it in left across here at the moment oh, I was going to say at the moment nothing on the crossover there was actually something there that must be way behind, but uh, fortunately not in our way. Again, just a quick glance at the map, nothing here. Going to go over the jump because of the line I've got there. Sometimes I'd go down the right-hand side of that ramp, but uh, with the line I'd got, I thought I might as well just uh, carry it over the jump. Okay, second place right behind us then, so we've got to be careful as we turn into this corner. Oh, that was a little bit messy, that's a shame. That's allowed that car to get in front. That's a nice uh, line through there though. If we can just not clip those tyres on the side. Again, I'm tight into here. Right behind the leader. Obviously most of the tyres have been cleared up here now. So we can really go up this right hand side here. Cars come in. I'm just going to have to go for it. Oh, quick dab of the brakes. And we've just managed to slip through. They're going to be on the crossover. No, they're clear of the crossover just before the leader got there. That's a shame. I was hoping they might have to do a break to let some pass. We can go down the outside of the ramp this time and we're clear here. Break and sling it in left. What's the gap behind? <laughs> I hadn't looked behind at all. And I was just looking there to see what the gap to the uh, car behind was. First chance I'd really had to look. And by the time I'd looked, they were past us. Okay, so five seconds down to the car behind this one. But we are down to third now. Again, see if we can get a good line through here. We did last time. Nice quick run through there. 
but the lead two have uh, have gone through there well as well as back mark could come in here whoa that's going to be close that was so close two of them couldn't really judge it because I couldn't see them but fortunately I just went over the crosser before they got there maintaining our gap to first and second ahead whoa that was so close nearly wipe out for uh, second place there and again here yep yeah, this time they've not got away with it they got away with it on the first one but uh, not on that second crossover so we are back up to second place then leader has pulled quite a way ahead two coming across here by the look of the map yeah there they go okay we're about two and a half three seconds ahead of third place now we'll have a look back in a bit see who that is if it's the same car that was uh, in second before or not is that the leader been wiped out it, I'm not sure no I saw the the cars crash there on the crossover but no that's the leader in the distance they are slowly slowly pulling further and further ahead and I don't think there's anything I can do about it I'm sort of going as quick as I can not making too many mistakes so I think we're going to have to rely on them to make a mistake if we want any chance of catching up obviously there is always the chance with so many back markers and these crossovers as well that uh, something could happen so it's well worth us staying as close as we can third place is right up on the back of us now cut that reasonably well but I'm going to go wide there right up by the side of me I'm going to hold my line yes oh they're over yep yeah, I was not going to make that easy for them I wanted the line right next to the ramp and really I was expecting to force them to go over the ramp really but they were determined to try and go down the side and uh, obviously got the two wheels either side of uh, of the ramp and flipped over is that them still behind yeah they've got it going really quickly so they're still only half a second behind back markers about a uh, back marker leaders about five seconds ahead now we've we got a clear run over here we're not gonna have to break that again will have allowed third place to catch up a bit couple of crash cars on the side there there's third place then pretty close behind as we start this final lap leader has been held up by those back markers there they are there's two back markers they've had to go over the jump so I am closing oh they've got through that crossover though in one piece we need to slip up the inside oh just got a bit of a gap third is followed us through and is right behind big crash there again was that the leader involved either way they are still going this is the battle for second place right next to me oh leader has been hit and we are closing up they've had a few uh, a few knocks but nothing that they've sort of been lucky really I say lucky I mean this <laughs> probably skillful but they've uh, yeah they've had a couple of knocks but nothing too bad that's really slowed them down just sort of glancing blows am I going to be able to hold this third place they're still there fairly close but we're okay through for a second place and that was a really good fun one that 59 seconds I wouldn't have thought that would be anywhere near the quickest no quite a few cars quicker and in particular that third place behind us so they would have got us in the end but we've managed to hold on well that's the end of this wreckfest online racing video if you liked it like it and subscribe and see you soon